Recently I've been mostly flying this Blade 150 with these uh, 1306 motors on it. Well, and these have been performing just fine. They uh, have 3100 kV, so that means they spin 3100 times per volt. But with these 3 inch props, they perform just fine. Now if you had 4 inch props, <laughs> of course these would perform a lot, lot better. But the limiting factor in this case is this frame. Anyway, so the next smaller size motor is the 1106 motors. And that's what I have here. This is an Eachine 1106 motor from Banggood. Let me go ahead and get this open and we'll get started looking at it. So this is the Eachine 1104. Oh, whoops, sorry. My thumb is in the way. <laughs> Okay, anyway, sorry, this is this is the Eachine 1104 motor. It runs at 4,000 kV. And I said it about the 1806 motors and the 1306 motors, and I'll say it again about this one. This is so small compared to what I'm used to. I don't know how this thing is going to have any power to lift up a quadcopter off of the ground, but it's supposed to. So as soon as I find some propellers out of the right size, I'm going to build, be building out a quadcopter using these and compare it to the 1306 motors I have on my current. Uh, Blade 150. Along with the Ishin motor, you also get a little bag of screws, and these are M2 by 4 millimeter screws, and there's several several of them in here. So let's go ahead and get some measurements off this real quick. Here's the shaft, 1.45 millimeters, and the whole thing is what 13.75, and from top to bottom, it's 12.83 millimeters. Now, I just still am having a hard time contemplating this thing having any kind of power to lift up a quadcopter. The DYS 1306 motor weighed in at 13.6 grams. So we'll go ahead and we'll try to weigh this one on here. And it comes in at 5.5 grams. <laughs> that is nearly 8 grams less than the 1306. So maybe these things have a chance of flying a uh, quadcopter after all since the weight of the motors themselves are so much less and the KV is a little bit higher. So here's the Sunny Sky 2204 and here's the Eachine 1104 and this just makes this thing look minuscule. This is the DYS 1806 motor compared to the 1104 Eachine. Here's the 1306 mounted onto a Blade 150 quadcopter frame. Here's the Eachine 1104 mounted onto another Blade 150 quadcopter frame. And even between these, you can just see how much smaller it is. I thought I ordered DYS motors too, but apparently I didn't and I have all Eachines. Uh, the only other thing I wanted to show you on this before I'm finished, it, the uh, wires on here are just so small too. I mean, it looks like they have like one strand going through these wires, which is, again, it's unbelievable to me. But again, I guess you don't, this thing isn't really going to draw a lot of amps just because of its size. So anyway, I'm looking forward to getting some propellers for this. I got ESCs coming and I'm going to put them onto this frame and hopefully uh, my son is going to end up flying around with me and we'll get some good videos of that here in about, a, I don't know, six months or a year. So don't, don't get your hopes up. But anyway, this is the, the, the Eachine 1104 motor. If you have any questions about this, leave me in the comments and I'll try to help you out as best I can. And thanks for watching.